Aloha YouTubers, this is Scuba Chris. This is the Nasi 3000, it's a Shimano Nasi 3000. Came out last year in 2016. Now it's September of 2017. I've used this reel on many outings, mostly at night. It's caught hundreds of pounds of fish. Um, I would say the largest uh, fish so far was a eight pound papilla, which is a trevally. I've caught four pound, um, up to a four pound grouper on it. Um, I caught up to a five pound barracuda on it. It's very smooth. It's lasted all this time, never any problems. So for real, a lower end reel that is under $100, it's really a great, great deal. Um, it's very hard to get real spinning reels under $100 that feels good and lasts this long. Okay, the uh, this Shimano uh, system feels pretty good. It the, This lower end reel has the same feel as the higher end reels. Very important, it has to feel the same because you're not looking at the reel when you're reeling in the fish. You're just feeling how the reel feels, okay? The 3000 model here only weighs 8.8 .8 ounces. It incorporates the famous Shimano X ship system. It has four point plus one bearings, meaning four bearings on the inside and one in the handle. All right, this is a extremely good feature for lower end reels that have four plus one. Many don't have that many. The line retrieve of all the units of the 1000 to the 5000 models are 26 to 41 inches. So the 3000 model here has a 36 inch uh, line retrieve, which means that for every full turn off the handle, you bring in 36 inches of line. It incorporates the famous front drag system. So, you know, when you, when you turn um, your knob in the front here, that's what controls the drag settings. All right. The drag power rating of all the units of the 1,000, 5,000 is from 7 pounds of the 1,000 to 24 pounds for the 4,000 and 5,000. The 3,000, like this model, has 20 pound um, max drag, which is pretty good for a 3,000. Okay, if you, this unit is great for fresh water or salt water applications. So if you want to use mono, 6 pound mono, it will take 230 yards. 8 pound mono, 170 yards. 10 pound mono, 140 yards. If you want to use braid like I do, 10 pound takes 200 yards. 20 pound takes 140 yards. 40 pound takes 105 yards. Now this one here, I did something unique. I only put in five pound braid into it. It took 300 yards and still has not even reached the lip and with that type of line you would think that it would break it does not because you have it's uh you have to combine it with a rod that can also take up the stress of, of fish and i've caught everything from an eight pound trevally to a five pound grouper to a five pound barracuda it's held up very very well 